There we go. Um, <laughs> whoops, let's see. Camera. Nope, camera. No, computer. There we go. There we go. Everything. Well. Whoops. Hey, Fox, how's it going? Oh, shoot. Okay, hang on. There we go. There we go. No, never mind. I'm not good. I just, I should just uh, buy the new key, buy a new camera. There we go. I should just buy a new camera. This one, this one, um, I broke the little jam piece on it, the jams into the bottom that holds it still, and it decides it wants to move every which way. So, ah. so it is nice and cold here today, and I do mean that literally, nice and cold. It was about a high of. Um, Six Celsius, <laughs> so it's still hoodie weather. So I'm happy about that, but I'm good. For taking advantage of relaxing this weekend. Back, Whoops! I did not want that car. I'm taking advantage of relaxing this weekend. I meant to do I don't know what stream yesterday, but I just oh that reminds me. But I'll get back to that in a second. Um. I don't know what I was going to stream yesterday, but I ended up just just relaxing through it. I tried to uh, get the um, get the rally course done yesterday. I was about eighty percent of the way through it and realized I messed up somewhere and couldn't repair getting back toward the point where I messed up. So I binned it, at least for the for right now. I'll get back on it probably. I think I'll, tr let's see, when will I have time to actually sit down and not be dumb about things? Um, yeah, I've need, I've really needed it. I had a little fun uh, doing liveries with cars yesterday. Do a mini car show. Get to do a mini car show. So the body kit on this uh, Porsche Carrera, <clears throat> the barn find one, allows it to very easily Put, allows you to very easily put vinyl over everything except the body kit parts. Yeah, let's hit all the right buttons today. So the little, okay. I'm just going to pull up into a spot over here. <clears throat> oh. I don't think that's how that was supposed to work. You were not showing us there when uh, <laughs> I started backing in. <laughs> So yeah, found the the Porsche logo, the same one I used. Um, well, I forget where I used it, but it's the same uh, one from the from the uh, you know where that everybody drop where they uh, you get the logos and stuff from the community vinyls. And then I found a Carrera um, like for the bottom of the door. But it's nice that the way the vinyl works. It gets it 99% of the way there. Where you just, where you, it doesn't cover the body kit. But if you look at the tires, so the two colors, so the, the highlights and the lowlights colors are the rim and the calipers. Thank you. 
So I had fun with that, figuring that out. Yeah, that one was fun to do, and like I said, the way, the way the weird, uh, livery editor works, it's weird that it works this way. So, there's that one. Let's see, for, um... Hang on, I gotta look at the playlist, because I did it for playlist cars. Buggies can't do anything with. Modern supercars, I didn't need to do anything. Wait. Oh, Land Rover, I don't, I didn't do anything with. Mini, yes, okay, Mini. So I did use one of your designs on the hood. I totally, I totally masked my logo. So everything that was dark blue is now a mask layer. So this is just a blue to black color shift underneath everything there. But yeah, the it looked. I was like going through the colors. Okay, what looks good? What looks good? You know what? Let's go white and black just for the stark contrast there. Yup. Yeah, this is this is for the um, the minis. This is my B class mini. So I was having a little fun with it yesterday. <laughs> oh, I love it. and I love the white. Even if it was plain white, I think just with that red and the grill and the just the black um, black, that small black uh, uh, strips on the fenders, the white and the black alone would be, is like very striking. Minis are, I gotta say, I don't know how they are as a, like, to drive, because I've never get, been able to drive one, but they do offer a lot in the way of good looks customization. You can do a lot with them. I was really disappointed that this one only came in the, um, green, the striping only came in with the green, like the, the, uh, traditional mini striping. I was disappointed about that, but then I changed directions and all went well. It's <laughs> I have seen this one before. Okay, yep, I have seen this one. I was like, wait a second. I was amused by the fact you had a pack you have a Pac-Man car, but I'm like, wait a second, I've seen this one before. Oh, this okay, hang on. Picture of my phone mode? Yes. My camera looks awful. Let's go drone mode. There we go. I need to get better at controlling this drone. Whoops. 
I like how it goes. I like how it goes. Your um, how the uh, split between the red and the yellow goes right off the the uh, edge of the opening across the car, and is unbalanced. I I love how that looks. Wait a second. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I like that. Whoops. Up. Oh, there we go. All right. I got to imagine, because you're doing it on what? Three different uh, views? Because you got to do the top. You got to do the front. I mean, that's, that's just the lining up of it portion. I mean, getting the line right would be a would be a uh, feat in itself getting it lined up and then getting it right I mean that's that's another level One up, oh, oh, that's why I can't get do anything. Oh, and then there's one more car which I didn't do anything with, but it needs recognition tonight for what it did last night. See that one? Were you masky? You would. See, I would think that one. Whoops. Whoops. All right, and then, not for any uh, livery reasons. Really, I just did that. Yeah, I got to imagine the, that the mask isn't very good for that. That one, that looks like it's every, you could put everything on top anyway. You could just layer the vinyls on top of each other. They seem to be going to check out every car that they come across. Alright, so last night I did the uh, Horizon Open event. And, um, Rust Orange Focus here decided to do some very mean things to, uh, to everybody else on the race. Funny thing is, the team I was on, theoretically, was actually good. That's that's a scary thing. I won the first race by 23 seconds. 
I won the second race by 17 seconds. That person needs to stop trying to be noticed. Um, yeah, I won the second race by 17 seconds. First race, I DNF'd nine out of the ten others in the race between my teammates and the AI. Second race, it was DNF'd eight of the other ten in the race. And third race, only because I went 75 or 80 percent, did anybody else <laughs> um, seven out of the other ten finished. This focus was, yeah, it was a beast. Got in front, and, uh, yeah, we notice you. You're being an idiot. What power am I running in this? Really good power, apparently. Um... Well, it's A class for, uh, but, um, six hundred and forty five horsepower. I mean, this part's probably going to be obvious, but it's A class super hot hatch rally. Yeah, it even had that crap. The Oh, the race that I only won by seven seconds was the crappy one in Guanajuato. But again, I was only running like 75-80% just to, uh... I got ahead of everybody and just made sure I didn't mess anything up. So... So I have to give the beastly focus a uh, little recognition for that last night. Yes, delete it, please. <laughs> delete it, please. There's no redeeming quality to it. It's not even a good it's not a good race. And apparently anytime I run open there I just uh Get to, I had to take it real easy and uh, run away from people. Yeah, that's one of about six or so that needs the de permanent deletion from the game. Permanent, permanently delete, do not want. Where are where are they? Where did they go? Are they the one that's just a 
just right in front of the gr uh the garage? Or was it the one that just tried to join the convoy, uh... Like, yeah. Mm hmm It's like... Cause I can't- I can't see who's in front- what's in front of the garage. And I don't see anybody else right now. But yeah, the... Oh yeah, the one that tried to join? Yeah! Roll up in your stock, um... Your stock F-150... Yeah, no... Roll up in a car that says Iraq on the side? Uh, what are you trying to do? Honk at everybody- honk at us to get noticed? Yeah, it's like... Calm down, dude. Like we're just sitting here under the shade, having a mini car show. Oh, great. Everybody's coming over now. <laughs> I love that blue. The blue and the black are just so... They're so... What's a good way to describe it? They're like so... Um, striking together, you know? There's a nice, great contrast there. Besides, I just love that blue. Maersk Sealand. Oh, I know I've seen this one. Okay, never mind. I have seen this one. I really need to get control of the uh, drones. So, whoops. A little close. A little far. There we go. Yeah, I love that blue and black together. Boy, calipers look really good with it, too. It makes it feel like it's Kind of a cold theme. Oh, I know I forgot to do on this car. Oh, okay, there's a drag race going on over there. It's like, why are they still beeping? Because there's a drag race going on. Okay. You know, they could put the lights, the drag strip lights back in the game so we don't all have to beep to start drag racing. <laughs> but yeah, isn't, isn't Maersk like one of the biggest, like, um, 
tripping companies in the world. I mean, it would make sense to see their containers like everywhere. Mm, excuse Okay, they have the car show. You know what I wish you could do? <laughs> now this is just gonna be weird. Don't mind don't mind my weird idea for a second. I wish I could do this. Whoops. Do the same paint as the as same as the paint I have as window tint. So the window tint does the same red to blue color change, depending on the angle you're at. Yeah, maybe that's not a weird idea. I don't know. So I gotta say, I'm not sure entirely what this, uh, this 9-11 Carrera is going to do. You're kind of doing this wrong. Why did you drag part of the drag strip into- What in the world is going on here? What is... What you been... What even is going on here? Okay, I'm amused by the bug over here. Oh, the... Oh, it's the desert dingo. Is that the desert day? Holy crap, what are, even is this? One of the Volkswagen uh, racing buggies. I gotta say, the Hawaiian, it's interesting with the Hawaiian Punch and all the food uh, sponsorships. Dude, you're annoying. Right here. I'm following you, annoying person. Annoying person has no plates. That's good. I, I think I'm annoying him with my drone right now.
See, that's really cool. I, I love that you got a ghost design on there. That would be something worth working with. Okay, because I'm having a hard time telling. Is that just is that regular chrome with uh, like a silver over it? Yeah, the oil effect. That's a good that's a good name for it. That's a really good name for it. Matte black base. Oh. That's kind of the opposite way I thought you did it then. Okay. Because I was thinking you went with the, uh, with like a black or a dark silver chrome. With a uh, with matte vinyls on it. Why is he? Tr Get the message, dude. We're not taking people in the convoy right now. Especially if you're going to act like a clown. It's like we're doing a car show. That's what it looks like. It looks like you it looks like somebody poured oil over over a car that's been uh, out a while, been kind of weathered a bit. Is it you that's bothering us? No new cars in shot. Okay. Uh, you know what? Let's do something so that way this guy will leave us a frick alone. I gotta imagine, it looks like it would be a fun drive. Alright, let's see. What is going to be something that just... Let's get out of the way. 
Let's see. Yeah, I feel like I feel like something like that would. I feel like an automobile that feels like something that uh, would be great for the uh, oval track. That feel that really feels like Saturday Night Banger Racing right there. The outpost is by the crop circle. Off-road vehicle at the race up. Barrier coast. Really? That's weird. Oh. For Barrier Costa right there. Yeah, okay, that makes sense then. You know what? This will be pain. Let's uh, get this one done first. What do, what do I need to take a picture of there? Off-road vehicle. Okay. Any off-road vehicle? Why am I... Okay, there we go. This is an off-road vehicle. I'm glad this is the last week of this stuff. Well, notice how last week they didn't even place this, uh, this stage. Yeah, they didn't even place this stage last week. It's like, okay. I saw that. Actually, I didn't see the update. I saw the, um... I saw a promo shot from it, and it was like, uh, this is definitely drag racing update. <laughs> or at least as heavily drag racing as they can make it. For me, the only part, fun part about drag racing is doing the, um, just racing with taking my stupid cars that shouldn't be dragsters and drag racing them. I don't want to do it seriously. It just seems... Literally boxed in by three, uh, three AI. All right. 
Sure, go for it, y'all. Crap, get around the corner. Bad thing is, I don't have any really good buggies. My buggies are mediocre. My buggies be mediocre. <laughs> yeah, it took you a minute to get past that one. I noticed that it was uh, not looking easy. I got stuck four buggies under a blanket with uh, three of the AI. It was like, oh, this is not good. Why was that buggy going backwards? Crap, I'm out of gears. I'm out of gears. There we go, I have a gear now. Eat a brick wall. Nope, you don't want to eat a brick wall. Cow, that's not a breaking zone.
on. Well, I... It's buggy aside, I, I... I know my buggy is... My buggies are mediocre. I don't have any that I've... Tuned to be great. I mean, they're not awful, but... I don't know how to get the top-end speed out of them. And then, of course, like an idiot, I was f literally fighting the buggy, like, fighting two of the AI buggies at the end. My buggy look, my, my Illumicraft looks like it's been through the car wash and yours looks like it's just got done racing. I've been through, I think I've been through the car wash. Yeah, my handling is just, is a tiny bit off of from where I'd like it, but it's, the handling I'm not going to complain about. For the most part, I throw it in, throw it into a corner, it, responds, it catches, and does what it's supposed to do. I need probably, I probably need a good three to five miles per hour out of it. Maybe two. Yeah, I don't even know what mine is, but I don't think it's much. Here, I'm just going to take a test with mine, see what it does. Oh, I don't have enough room for it. Oh, that, never mind. <laughs> I don't know what the heck I was thinking I was going to do there. See, this feels like it sits, though, when it turns. So that's, that's what I like about it. It feels, like, it feels like I can sit it sideways and it'll respond properly. I don't really want to go through the... Uh, I don't want to go through the uh, um, trailblazer, so. This thing's also horrible in accelerating in sixth gear.
Yeah, see, I'm flat out right now. I only got to 134 on the downhill. And I got it to like 130, 127, 128 on the flat. So if I could get it up to 130, I'd actually be happy with it. Well, that worked. <laughs> yeah, on flat sections, I met, I topped out at 128. Oh, probably. This thing is, um, I know the weight is like 2,260 pounds. Let's, oh, I don't have, uh. I don't know if I have that one or not. Twenty two It must be heavy. How is yours half again as heavy as mine is? That's not what I meant to do. There we go. No, that's the wrong buggies. Cool. Like I remember, you just said a lot more weight in yours. See, if I ever wanted to play around with an aerial nomad to try to get that to work. But yeah, none of these buggies I have, I've ever gotten work truly, truly right. Never mind, I know what I did there. I know what I did there. <laughs> that is S1. Um So if that's S1 Holy crap. I'm just imagining S1 what you can get that thing up to in a race. Mm. 
862 is... Wow. I guess that makes sense. Eight sixty two maxed out makes sense. You're never going to get good handling rankings from a buggy. You're never going to get good handling rankings. Your your power to weight usually is going to be good though. You won't get an advantage there. Oh, that makes sense. I mean, I think during, for I think for like eighty percent, seventy five percent of the races, I think that's the better call. I can I can I'll never fault any I'll never fault you or for or anybody for going acceleration over uh, top end in this game. <laughs> That's got a lot of power. Yes, that's a, uh... That is definitely, uh... A little bit on the ridiculous side. Why did I do this? Why did I do this? Whoops. Why do I have this pick up at the top of S1? Oh boy. You know, I should actually put some off-road tires on this and see what happens. That radiator must be uh, ready to catch uh, stray bits of whoever's not ready for uh, launch there.
I keep for I keep forgetting I can't collide with players not in the convoy. I'm still amused by the fact that this truck is S1. And I don't know why I did it. Yeah, I have no idea why I made this truck at, at uh, top of S1 class. Bye, Shay. Enjoy your flight last time? <laughs> That worked perfectly. Great, the locals are like, oh, they're out again, aren't they? Chatsy wanted the hell out of there, didn't care what was in the way. <laughs> that taxi did not care that that taxi did not care that other car was there. Just plowed right through it. Whoops, that is bad. I need to find that real quick. Ah. There we go. There we go. Ow. I am not built to bend that many directions. That's S that one's S one. Hmm. Interesting. I didn't realize there were any Polaris uh, buggies in the game. Whoops. There we go.
where else in the world are you going to see a uh, VW Doka and a uh, Polaris traveling 170 miles down the hot per hour down the highway? This one doesn't do clean donuts, I don't know what's going on. For something that probably what shouldn't be the way it is, this truck does really well. I gotta say, I wish I remember how we got this. Well, I wish I remember what season we got this. But. I might need to find a way to get this truck into a rotation somehow. I don't know where I'll put it, because it's definitely interesting, but I've got to get it somewhere in rotation somehow. Looks like the mini I tried to uh, tune up for the mini event for the mini championships. Whoops. Yeah, so originally what I was going to do, what I was trying to do was go with the, uh, oh, what is it called? The X Raid. Got that all up, realized it's just bad. And somehow, the less power, smaller engine, almost as heavy, Countryman works a lot better. Hold on, that's something. Well, hopefully got roll bars in there, because that's what I'll hold on to. Got roll bars in there? No? No roll bars? Alright, holding on to the dash.
Oof, that was a head first collision with a van. So that's rated for 213 miles per hour. Jeez. <laughs> Might smash the back end of a van. Uh, this is B class. This this is the mini for the championship. It's B class. <laughs> and it just took that. Uh, whoops. It just it just took that car and uh, moved it. It literally just moved that car like it was nothing. How did... Never mind. Okay. All right, countrymen, don't fail me now. Mini X-Ray, Mini X-Ray, Mini X-Ray, three Mini John Cooper works. Oh, four, because the buggy as well. I'm the only one running the Countryman. Okay.
Those parts give me a little bit of a wacky time trying to get in the right gear. This portion's good, though. I'm failing this vehicle if I don't get a 49 second uh, or 50 second uh, lap here. Oh, no problem. No problem. That was a nice little, uh, that looked like a nice little fun battle for the lead there. It's this one, okay. It's this one. It's this one. <laughs> oh, this is going to be in the way. What is AI going to do against two, two, uh, two people whose strength is basic is off road? Especially rally. What are you going to do when you're strength when you're facing people whose strength is rally in rally and you're AI?
Alright AI, this is where you're not going to like me very much. Oh my. The AI really can't do anything with us. Oh god. Way late on the brakes there. Hey, uh, this is the only place you, you're going to be able to keep up with me. You might as well try to make a pass. Because here, you're not going to make a pass. I really tried to do everything I could the first half of the last lap to uh, let the driver cars have positions. <laughs> you know, I have one of those tuned and I don't know why I didn't look into it. Yeah, that's, uh, which one is that? That's the, uh, oh, wait, hang on. Oh, the x ray all four. Okay, I do have one of those tuned. Like, I knew I had one of these. I didn't even try it. When the other x-ray didn't work, I, uh... I just, uh, went immediately to the countrymen and tuned it. There, you can... Hi, construction. Might need to work on that wall for us. Hi. 
Uh, truck death. No, I don't think so. But, but yeah, it. You know what? This feels like it might be a. I might have this one tuned up half decently too. Nope. Never mind. That oversteers like hell. That's good, though. That's good. Unless you need to use the brakes, the better. I don't think I have a picture of either of these. What do I mean, either of these? We both have the same vehicle out right now. Yeah. Actually, my countryman is this pretty much the same way. I just forgot to let off before going into that first turn at the, on the last lap. <laughs> We're blocking traffic. Everybody's probably wondering why cars aren't spawning on the map. Because we got them all right here. We got them all. Now they're starting to... Some of them are driving in reverse. Uh-oh. We're going to have cars freaking out in a second. Nope, never mind. Sorry, I got I've got the truck freaking out now. Nope, never mind. The F one fifty. Second in line. <laughs> Six, seven. Well, they they won't be able to go anywhere if you stay there, will they? Actually, apparently, it's my new favorite activity. All right, so we got the van, we've got the F-150. That's decided to take its anger out on... Oh, we got another F-150. What the heck is that? Okay, that's a focus, I thought so. We're apparently piling up Fords here. F-150. Oh, we finally got a Colorado. Hello. Older VW. VW Scirocco? Oh, no. Golf GTI. A little older though. Then we got then we got another focus all the way out here. I find it amusing how it's badged as a Ford, but it's not badged with anything else. This car looks beat up. Like, really badly for an AI car. So, yes, there are eight. Three, four. You're staying there. Five, six, seven, and eight. And now they've all disappeared.
after all, what else is there left for this week? The last week of the last glorious week of four championships. Even if they're not all the best championships of, that Horizon has to offer, at least there's four championships. Why? Why? Do you see what tomorrow's... Do you see what tomorrow's challenge is? Hey, wait a second. Wait a second. Do I have to do Tuesdays? Do I have to do anything for Tuesdays? There, I'm going to have to do something for Tuesdays to... I'm sorry, this should, this should count here. I'm sorry, this should count as preemptively getting the, the, uh, equip the race suit done. This should preemptively count. I mean, there is no reason for this not to preemptively count. I've been in a race suit all season. Yeah, playground games, if we could have fewer of the outfit dailies, that would be great. Wow, the only one that actually makes sense to do, to have as a daily cha a challenge. Mm. I would like to know if there's anybody that can't fly 500 feet in a hypercar. If they can't do that, I would like to talk to them. Ask them if they know how a hypercar actually works. Three stars and trailblazers. That's the only actual challenge I see. I gotta admit, though, the burning rubber one, at least that one was a little bit fun, too. Drift at the drift at the outposts. I mean, at least it takes a little work, but but yeah. Playground games, please give me Tuesdays pre. Uh, please just give me Tuesdays just for existing, please. Thank you. Yeah, if you can't get a if you can't get a hypercar to fly five hundred feet, it's like um maybe you're playing the wrong game. Come back, come back when you're old enough to actually play the game, please. If you can't do that one, all right. Let's see. What do we need? We need a Land Rover. The modern supercars and barn finds. For something that nobody asked for. I know I didn't ask I know I didn't ask for the extreme E.
So which one did you say had the Guanajuato races? Was that the uh, modern supercars or was that the barn finds? I like my cars for both, but I don't know if I'm really wanting the Ooh, Nissan Titan. I'm surprised I haven't uh, done anything with the Nissan Titan. All right, this will be pain. At least the oval track is. Uh, Easy enough. I should not sit on my shoulder like that. I know, that sounds like a physical... Tunnel 1 is part of the barn... F oh. That's... That's right. Okay. Because that is a street scene race. That makes sense. That's a horrible street scene race, but it makes sense. Oh, I should probably sit up so I can actually see my screen. I mean, that would be pretty dumb of me to stay half hunched, leaned over behind my monitor. Not being able to see the full screen, that would be kind of dumb of me. Corvette C8. Ooh, okay. What the hell was that? Three runs on three laps on the oval track, please. <laughs> wow. I would love to know what the AI was what the AI were doing there. They seem to not want to, uh, they seem to not want to be passed by either of us, so they didn't know what to do, <laughs> but we were just blown by them. Oh, Cathedral Circuit, yikes. Okay, this is gonna go badly. At least for me, this is going to go badly. I am not good on this circuit.
Womp womp. No, don't push me. Hello? That you got a turn. No, that's not going to work. This is a terrible track for, for uh, cars like this. So, if they're going to push me like that, I need to be able to push them back. I hate Cathedral Circuit. Well, at least that one's over. Holy cow, that was bad. I'm very disappointed, uh... That's alright, it's- it's AI, so... The- AI doesn't matter. I'm very disappointed, though, that that oval- the oval race was only three laps. And that the AI couldn't figure out how to keep their heads out of their asses. Because, yeah, that first race, I'm not sure what they were on. I'm thinking they were, uh, I'm thinking since today is 420 that the, uh, Drivatars were partaking before the, uh, races and, um, partaking a little too much. And the tunnel, the tunnel run is always a. <laughs> oh, okay. So, you, oh, okay. Hang on. Now it just came back to me. That's why I saw that. That's why I saw that the, the, the driver car stuck on that um, on that tunnel run just. <laughs> 
<laughs> Don't worry, I do the same thing to the AI when I get the chance. It, it's fine. I do I do the same thing to the AI. Yeah, that uh It's like it's like I was thinking, okay, five because it's normally five laps on the oval. I was thinking initially, okay, five laps, that short but doable. And then all of a sudden, I just had the AIs just keep pounding me into the wall. It's like, it's like, what are you doing? Oh, excuse me. It's like, what are y'all doing? We're on the straightaway. Don't cut all the way across the track. <laughs> But yeah, that would have that would have been an interesting race playing out. That was that would have been interesting to see how that would played out because you had the low, you had the bottom line going, and I had the top line going. Yeah, the. This is another, this is, the uh, Cathedral is, uh, another one that needs to go. Cathedral Tunnel Run, um, that, that's, uh, scramble we did earlier. Urban Cross Country. I'm almost getting rid of racing in Guanajuato, almost. I like the plaza circuit a little too much. I like that. I think that's a good call. Aim below. A to C. A, A, A to C. Don't do D with it either. Because holy cow, I don't want to see cars struggling to climb up that last uh, that last hill before the final right on uh, Cathedral. I don't want. I don't want to see it. It will be painful to watch. Hey, I got a Jaguar I pace. And an extreme E that I didn't ask for. I don't want the extreme E. You can have it back. Take it back, Horizon. Playground games, take it the extreme E back. I'll take I'll take the vehicle credits. I'll take the vehicle credits instead of the extreme. -y. I'll take the half pay. I'll pay you half the credit. I'll pay you Horizon Playground Games. I'll pay you half the credits to not give me the extreme. -y. Yeah, the starting line for Cathedral is... The whole thing is just really... Bad. But the starting area is... Really tight. And then you got that kink to start with. And then the finish line is basically... One car wide. It's basically single line through. You're really not doing much to get a second car through there. I mean, I'm thinking, whoops. Oh, perfect. Whoops. 
I'm thinking about this width right now of our two cars is what the uh, what you have to drive down on that final stretch. Oh look, we're uh, jacking up traffic again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven for sure. But yeah, that, that finish stretch I think is about that wide. <clears throat> Three wide going into the hairpin is always a bad idea. I don't know of one race in this game where three wide in any of the hairpins works. Now that I'm done demoing how wide it feels like the road is. What in the heck are we doing here, phone? Um, is there a posting again? Okay. Okay, cool. Yes. There we go. I gotta say, the launch on this thing is amazing. It feels like on a scale of 1 to 10, it's like a 12. So we've got a bicycle out in the road. Here, let's see. I'll, I'll take it up to 60 right now. I went 0 to 60 to 0 in that time. I haven't timed it, but... That was zero to sixty to zero. Zero to seventy to zero. Oh, I did not really want to do that. I don't think that van's happy with me right now. I 
the whole tunnel system is a pain in the neck. If I'd remembered that that turn went into the tunnel, I would have turned the other direction. Not what I meant to do, but there we go. All right, so there's either, what is there left? There's barn finds and then there's land rovers. You know what, I'd rather do cross country than as the finale than uh... But yeah, these tunnels are just... I think the whole tunnel thing is just bad. I mean, they're not, they're not great. Oh, I'm on my arm again. My heart rate is too damn high. My heart rate is too damn high. Why is my heart rate so damn high? My heart rate is too damn high. Holy cow. Apparently I made a lot of barn finds usable. One of these days, I'm going to get a good draw for a... We're going to get a good draw for a trial. That I can go full creative on... Uh, and will want to go fully creative on a trial vehicle's livery. How many 911 Carreras are there going to be? Huh, just... Right, two fifty. Oh, why is there? Why is? Oh, come on. Come on. Why is there a tr out of control trophy truck in front of me? Find the line I took to make that other corner. It's fine. Cause I say it's fine. It worked, right? This this Porsche is very oversteery. It's squirrely. Forza matchmaking, I would like to know why that uh, Toyota was in the uh, win this race. That is not a good uh, street scene vehicle at all, and I don't think it actually has any kind of road tires that it can uh, swap to. Yeah. 
Yeah, this is kind of, this is just going to be a, uh, one of those things that's, uh, this is just going to be one of those championships, isn't it, where it's just going to be like, driver cars don't know what they're doing, so, let's, let's already take, let's already take us, already, feeling like beating up the, on the driver cars, and, uh, Let's just, uh, make it double. <laughs> Gee, who, who would have thought that that Toyota T100 wouldn't do well in a road race, in a street race. <laughs> yeah, world domination once again. It's like, oh. I tell you, the AI were going puff puff pass a few too many times before these races. Maybe a few hundred each? I'm not sure what they're doing. Wow. Right, get out of the way. Oh, that was sweet. Let's save that. It's very, very weird to have a car that feels like a power build that actually doesn't have much power. Ah, I would have did what we did what I needed to do, but I would have liked to have gotten by the AI off the start a little better. That tro that uh, Toyota T100, it's just a pain in the neck.
So Korea is just a wee bit oversteery. Actually, I think I left your rear, 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 rear wheel drive as well. Alright, you know what? Let's take a look. Yep, I did leave it rear wheel drive. <laughs> I did not see that, but I'm not surprised. Just seeing how the uh, AI were, the driver tars were kind of swarming, like around. Let's, there we go. See, Ferrari really should, uh, Ferrari really should get a nice, uh, get a nice, uh, like a nice horse livery that they could throw on there like you've got for this. They really need to, uh, Ferrari need, really needs to take a look at your car here. And be like, yes, we do, we do like this. Um, Michelle, you're facing the wrong way. Get back in the driver's seat. Yeah, there's some there's something to these old uh there's something to these old uh, racers. There's something there's something to be uh Oh, that's why I can't use mine. Apparently I've decided that it needs to be tuned to to A class. You know what? I'm glad I I'm glad I decided to give it a livery. I feel like this should go, this I think if I get rid of the uh, the oversteer it has this will be this can be really this could be good for B class. Ferrari really should look into an idea like you've got going on here. They really should. It's just too bad they'll be too stuffy about it to be like, No, we cannot do that. We cannot do anything to make our cars more interesting looking. They must be the boring red. Did I get the snobbiness uh, feel right for that? I actually kind of feel like I more hit of a, a, a congested Donald Trump, but that was supposed to be snobby Ferrari not liking cool ideas for their cars.
yeah, they need to figure that out. They need to figure out, hey. I mean, I know I'll probably never be in a position to buy a Ferrari. But if I was, their snobbiness and their insistence on being the, uh, you must do whatever we like with your car, would steer me away from them. Because I bet you, I bet you, if I went up to Porsche with this car, they'd look at it, they'd stand around, they'd look at it, and they'd say, that's pretty neat, we like this, that's pretty cool. You could take your car to anywhere, and they'd be like, hey, we like this, glad you're enjoying our car. Ferrari's like, this ruins the sanctity of our brand. No. <laughs> I think I just got closer to Arnold Schwarzenegger there. Oh boy, I'm uh... Oh, oh, okay. Let's get the trial done. Because if I can find it, I've got a video to show you because it, I saw it. I'll send you the link. I saw it. And it was like, is this for real? Is this dude for real? And it is, seriously, is this dude for real? Let's, let's start the process. I got, what, minute 15? Yeah, I'm... It's a YouTube short. Let's see, um, I need history, probably you, there we go, let's see. History, shorts, there we go. Why does that, to me, why does that from this weird angle look like a cross between a PT Cruiser and a BMW? Am I crazy? I'm wondering if I'm crazy with what I'm seeing. Oh, crap. I hope this is the one that I want, because I don't remember which one I want. Yeah, I don't feel the need to decorate a, uh, a Land Rover. 
the Z Z4 coupe, okay. Or Z3, Z3, okay. The angle I had it at made the front end of it look kind of like, almost like a, uh... Like it had the front, similar front end to a, uh... And I know it's just a weird angle I had my camera turned at. It made it almost look like it had the front end of a PT Cruiser. Great, Pedro has decided not to tune. Um, AI, you literally just stopped. Great, I've got Tegan and or Pop wait, Pablo and Antonia fighting in front of me. Coming through. Why are you... Pedro, get out of the way! Holy crap! Tegan! Oh boy. Um Tugan did it again. I had yeah, I got a bad start too. I missed the checkpoint almost immediately. And I've got a fun clip of Tegan as well. for a flight she uh she was not having fun she was she got some frequent flyer miles
Dude, is you being ahead of me that important? Is giving the driver tars two positions that important, stupid? I got my hands full of this vehicle. I don't need to get my hands full with a teammate. Good. Good, 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 good. Yeah, that, uh, that here, was the here Sugar 1440, they're kind of an idiot. They were deciding that, um, their, their seventh place position was so important, they couldn't, uh, they couldn't let me buy. I, don't mind me, I'm apparently, I'm... Having a problem. I am having a problem here. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you for getting me out of that. I thought I was going to be uh, going through the bottom of the map any second now. Staying away from those trees. Holy crap. So, yeah, that here sugar person decided that their seventh place was so important, they were going to not only knock me out of the way, but cost both of us two more positions. All right, so this is, uh, okay, so this is, why did I save this one? Oh. Okay, so this was earlier from when, uh, the vehicles we were knocking around just didn't care anymore. They went full Phil Collins. So watch this taxi I just turned around. Taxi just doesn't care. Taxi wants out. <laughs> but yeah, we've got one... We, the teammates are wonderful, aren't they? 
So here's Tegan. Here's Air Tegan. So watch Air Tegan right here in front of me. Now she's behind me. So Air Tegan's going to come flying by in a moment because I got slowed up. I gotta watch this again because that flight is weird. It's funny, but it's weird. There we go. I mean, the way she flew is weird, and then I just love the uh, exclamation point of her in the tree. Tegan Oh, the... I know, I know today, at least still here in the U.S., it's 4.20. But I don't think that should be affecting the drive guitars at all. That's just my thought. But yeah, it's almost like there was a jump pad, a small jump pad in the ground, and Tegan found it. Oh, yes. How do I copy? Where's my copy? Hang on, there's the copy. This guy bought a Bugatti Veyron. It's just the start of it. Oh, at least at least that's a, a digestible in a minute or less. Because just too rich for my blood.
Yeah, it'd be it's interesting because I gotta figure out what that guy's doing to make that kind of money because I need to copy him. That's uh That's uh more money than brains since in, in that situation. Yeah, buy a Bugatti from a Koenigsegg dealer, so that way you can get a Yesco. Tow it with- wait, what did he tow it with? It's like... Yeah, exactly. It's like, you don't need to flex your cars here. But I just found this so ridiculous. Yeah, I just found this so ridiculous. That's what that's why I had to share. It was I found it that ridiculous. Cuz I'll tell you what, if I had that kind of money, I wouldn't I wouldn't be uh well I wouldn't be trying to flex having that money, but I'd find much better use for it than uh towing high-end car after high-end car with a high-end car and buying a high-end car so I could buy another high-end car. Unless I, like, win the, uh, Mega Millions when it's, like, over a billion dollars or something. But I still wouldn't be, uh... I still wouldn't be, uh... doing that, doing that guy's stunt right there. I'm on top of Mexico! And then, and then he goes and, uh... Basically replaces everything in the, uh... Um... Well, I guess as close as, uh... As close as we could... I mean, I'm really, I really only care honestly about whoops. That's changed car. The two championships I'm really only am uh, worried about are the are anything off road, rally, cross country. Give me those. Road, I'll road will sort out. Yep. See, that's the fun part. I think this, it's like, like, it's not too difficult to get it done. It's just more fun to, it's more fun to race with and with somebody and see how your cars, like you said, work together. Now, first multiplayer, on the other hand, I mean, that's a little, uh... Yeah, I think I just managed to beat a Land Rover Defender. Sweet. Yeah. And like I said, I've gotta I've gotta take a little bit of the oversteer out of that Carrera. And it and it will be a uh, rotation piece.
Yes. Yep. Yeah, that, that countryman I'm also very happy with. That also will go in the rotation. The only one that won't right now is this Land Rover Defender. Apparently I've decided to roll it down the hill. Down the mountain. But yeah, that Countryman is really something. I'm really happy with how that turned out. I ha I'm thinking I picked the wrong one. Because I've got three of them. But I'm wondering if this is the, uh, the SVR is the one that I needed. I mean, it doesn't help when I blow right by a checkpoint like it doesn't exist right off the start of the uh, race in the trial. Okay. True. True it is. Oh, where is it? Where is the trial? Where is the trial? Come on. I know I know where you are. No, it's got to be over here because we were down by... Uh... There we go. There it is. Yeah, I just... I had a full head of steam and um, my mental navigation decided that yeah, the one that I couldn't get around. He was he was in my way. Uh, he was in my way for a good while because he started right by me and uh, was loving the drift. Oh my gosh, this is so much, uh... Yeah, this one's... I think this one actually would have been the one that I wanted, that I realized. Oh no, I wouldn't have liked that understeer. Holy cow, this thing is fast, though.
this thing's a little too fast. I need to, uh... Well, it's not too fast. It's, uh... Faster than I thought it would be, though. And this is where Tegan took her flight. I should have looked at I should have looked at which of these I had because if I had realized that I had this one. Okay, so this one was fast. I just need to uh, work on the handling a little bit. <laughs> game game don't stop the ai at the finish line that is not intelligent nobody would do that Nobody, nobody would stop dead at the finish line like, yep, this is what I'm going to do. Yeah, I just need, I need to figure out time to, uh, to sit down, make sure I map out the route right. There's leaderboards. Oh. Yeah, I would love to have another, uh, have another, tr have a trial where we can use the Lancer. Yes, please. Hang on, let's do this. Let's have a little fun with people. I think everything will be road racing. I think I think every I think every um I think every championship is going to be involve at least one drag race. Which is really dumb.
Yeah, I think it's really dumb. I don't. I really don't like that. Uh, because you know, or I'm 95% sure, maybe 97% sure. Not 100, but close enough to it that um, that I feel confident enough to make this statement. They're not going. To, they're not going to do a uh, rally racing uh, series. They're not going to do a series of off-road racing, so rallying cross country. They won't do it. I mean, I'm glad we have enough of those to uh, go around, but it's not. Uh, it's not fun. It's not fun when, uh, geez, people really don't like racing. This will be interesting. These. I don't think I've ever seen a rally tuned Crown Vic before. Yeah, I can I just... I just feel like that's just a really weird, uh... It's a really weird, uh, car to be thrown out here for this, uh... For this series of races. Ah, oh, that sucks. I was looking ahead to the turn and I decided uh, that checkpoint was not important. Rally Monte Carlo. Oh man, that's a car that needs to come out too. Yeah, Rally Monte Carlo needs to uh, stretch its legs.
I do still like the Countryman. I wish I could just get one more upgrade in it. That's the only thing I wish I could do with it. Still a great car. Still a great car. I think the problem with it was that the only upgrades that it had put it well into A class. So say, come on, let's go. I mean, I know the purpose of having the collision slow down, but I don't think that in that instance you can even try to decipher what happened there is me trying to wall ride. I forgot to turn. I literally forgot to turn. I don't know what course I thought, I don't know what circuit I thought this was. But I was determined that I was going straight. Yeah, that was just a suggestion. It's fine. That wall of the arrows doesn't they don't mean anything, right? And then, now I was really about to say something stupid. I was about to say, I feel like my car went faster yesterday. Well, duh. It's a, it was A-class. A-class a little bit faster.
That was a much better last lap, but yeah, you might want to try that. You don't have to, but that's a very strong suggestion. It is a very strong positive suggestion that it's a very good idea that you turn right so you don't hit the wall. What even is that driving suit? Does that driving suit have race tracks all over it? No, let's not. Let's not. Reason let's not? Racing only against two people is not as fun. Let's see, what do we got here? It's... Where is it? Well, it's not. <laughs> yeah, the suggestion is the wall might... The wall might hurt a little bit if you run straight into it. It, it'll be a good one, yeah. It will be... There we go. Yeah, it'd be a good one. I can, I can, I think this is especially, um, especially something like Caldera Scramble and, um, your more technical, your little bit more technical, uh, courses. That's a little bit more technical stuff there, because straight ahead speed is not the strength here. Do we really have to put one of those uh, Urban Rebels into every race? Oh, that's a Taviscan, still. Do we have to put an Electric into every race? Come on, come on, Forza. I'm not sure that we've had anything that's... Like, for actual events, we've had that... I'd actually be able to use it. Because there was something I was looking to use one of the Shirakos for, and it was the wrong Shirako for the event.
Whoops. I overestimated my uh, ability to turn there. See, was that the... I think my B-Class Scirocco is actually, uh, for word. I think my A-Class Scirocco is, uh, would, would have worked for uh, cross-country. I think that's the problem I had. Because I wanted to use the Scirocco. Yeah, I think I have an A-class rally Scirocco. I definitely did not do that yesterday with this uh, countryman. Yeah, let's see. So the Shrocker, I also could have... Yeah, see that one's A-class. And then the B-class, which is the one that I turned red, the red and black, is uh, for road. Hey, I've got I've got another Scirocco here. I've got a Scirocco. Let's see if I can uh, make a B class rally Scirocco. And then we also got the question. Uh, whoops. That you brought up. Uh, what was it Tuesday? About me not using a Toyota. I think we can also try to fix that a little bit too. Custom upgrade. All right, let's see. Whoops. So tires are going to be the first thing I'm going to look at because if those push into A class, which they will not. Okay, cool. No, it's front wheel drive. I don't need to change that. Race brakes, rally suspension. There we go. Sway bars. Let's make this able to shift. Give some Get a rally diff. Nope. Alright, good tires. Front tires because those are my drive wheels. Bump up the rears a little bit. Okay, wait, how many points, how much PI do I have? I have 693. 
Really? Huh. Six eighty two. This just looks better. It's so weird to uh to me that I uh No it's not. Okay, that'll up speed. That'll up speed. You should up everything. Good. Whoa. Displacement. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, I can't... Okay, let's use that. I think I can get better bang for my buck elsewhere. Can't get bang for the buck there. Twenty nine hundred pounds, two hundred and eighty seven horsepower. That should be good. Should be good. All right. No, no, no. All right, there we go. There we go. Um, it's a weird gear ratio. Okay, that works. That will work. I don't you know. You need to be able to be thrown around. Don't even really care if you're hooked up. Yeah, that should be barely hooked up. Um, soften you a bit. Okay, um, I, I was about to say, I don't remember putting a front down force, um, yeah, I don't care there, I was just using the arrow for the PI drop. Play with the uh, diff in a minute. Oh, wow. All right, what color do I need more of in my life right now? What e? What color or colors do I need more of in my life right now? Uh, 
So let's see. Oh, I can't adjust the colors there. I wanted to see if I could do red with the uh, white triangles or something like that. Okay. You can't see me. Oh. Hang on, where is it? There you go. Can't see me. I'm hidden. That's not a bad idea. Okay, let's make sure it works first and then we can then I can start laying that out. Alright, so there's a few places this proving trip has to go. <laughs> My logo on wood. What in the heck is going on there? Okay. Okay. Oh, this engine is rough on the start, first through third gear. Need a little bit more turn. Needs to turn a little better. Yeah, the understeer is uh, definitely not it here. The speed was, the funny thing is, even as bad as it is getting up to speed with the, uh, with it not smoothly going up the uh, RPM range, it's still got good speed.
I did soft. Yes, I did soften them. Actually, I, I'm going to soften the front more, and um, because that definitely will need to uh, happen. Especially with it being a front wheel drive car. Yeah, because I think it's at 15 right now? I mean, the car is not slow. The car itself is not slow. Yeah, I will. I I uh, soften the anti-roll bars, and it's going to be. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if I can put down a forty-nine second on uh, Caldera Scramble. So I just want to throw it and I can't. Yeah, this thing doesn't want to be thrown around very much. It just doesn't want to be thrown. It wants to be handled gently. I don't want that. Yeah, I've been taking to any... Usually when I see understeer in cars, on my road cars, it's like... I've been doing that same thing. I've been messing with the... Uh, Messing with the, uh, especially the front sway bar. Cool. We were like not working at all, so let's. Yeah, because if I, if I don't, uh, I mean, if I do get the understeer out of this thing, like I said, I think I could put down, I think I could have, I probably could have gotten almost a full second out of it. I'm getting an extra full second out of, uh... Jeez. That would be significant. Percentage of, uh, lap time-wise. That would be 2% faster.
There we go. There we go. Okay, that maybe wasn't the best of, uh, the greatest of moves, but... Yeah, that was just... Okay, that was driver error. It worked the first lap. I'm still, still understeering like crazy. I think I got it below 50. Oops. Yeah, I just need a... It's weird because the back end is not letting go. You know, the back end is being very obedient. Though, if I have to get used to that, I think I can, so...
There you go. That's how you do it. You know, I have to wonder, has anybody for uh, Playground Games ever thought maybe this trail right here would have been a good for a race? That I just went around? Whoops. Well, that was a mistake. Dang, understeer? If I didn't understeer, I wouldn't have went through the, uh... Through the, uh... Through the, uh, trip laser. The starting gate. say this car isn't really doing that badly considering it is B class This is uh, not the best thought out thing they ever came up with, is it? This will be absolutely stupid. If I put up my best time with a B-class car. Where the... Finish. Oh, you've got to be kidding me.
What a jack wagon move. I would have had my best, uh, or almost, well, it would have been very likely, I would have had my best time for that, too. What card did I do? The Raptor. The Raptor? A-Class? Shaco's tired. It fell asleep. Yep. I have to wonder if there's a tundra that, uh. What if there's a tundra that would like a shot at this? There should be a t okay. There's a Tacoma. I thought there was a Toyota Tundra as well. There is not. The Tacoma. I don't think. Mm, I don't know if I like that. Oh, holy cow! Okay, hang on. So I've used this GR Supra for something. So I've used the Supra, I've used the Forerunners. I've used two different 86s. Apparently the Supra as well. Maybe this MR2. Yeah, the Forerunners are only going to be for trials. Or uh, C-Class Championships. So I've got two MR2s I've used. And possibly the 74 Celica. I'm disappointed. I was hoping that doesn't seem like a smart idea. Uh, that's almost as heavy. Well, here we go. We're going to try to build another just monster truck. Not a monster truck, but a truck that's a monster. Yeah, that the forerunner. I mean, it's C class. I don't. I don't know what I think I'm going to get from it, but why does that seem like a bad idea? Why does it seem like a bad idea to put a V10 in this in this uh, Tacoma? It just feels like a bad idea to put a V10 in that. Since I'm not worried about hitting a class restriction with this.
Hmm. Let's see, let's give you a seven speed. Whoops, that's not what I'm, that's still not what I'm looking for. All right, so we will try that next. Nineteen hundred fifty six horsepower. Okay. I just have to remember I'm leaving uh, that untuned for now. For now. All right, so reading or come on, controller, there we go. I mean there's I'm surprised there's no sh older Chevy trucks. See, where are the older Chevy trucks? Where's the K10? There's, there's one. Hoping that, hoping that comes with an engine swap. And the funny thing is, I knew what you were going for. The fight, it because I knew you were going for the Chevy. For some reason, that racing. Let's see. Yeah, give me more speed to start. Wait, which one? The V8 twin turbo? Racing V8? No, V8 twin turbo, okay. Um, I don't... So they'll, throw, they'll throw that engine in with anything. They'll, they'll, put that, they'll put that engine with the... Uh, come on, give me our four tires. There we go. Oh, let's not do that. Let's we can go nice chunky funds, but let's go really chunky backs. There we go. Let's kind of give it a triangular stance. Let's do a little stopping power. Give it a little ground clearance. This is going to be a Jimmy. There's no. Oh, that would be bad. Oh, for the Funko engine. Oh, that's. Uh... <laughs> well, I guess. Well. And they'd like to put it for everything too. That's kind of strange to me. Let's let's throw this with everything. Eighty-six Ford XL extend uh Ford words not working. Words not working. Words should probably work. Thousand forty-two horsepower. All right. F1, okay, 86 Ford F150 XLT. That could be a good one. Okay, that's 75 Bronco. So let's, there we go. Ooh.
the truck before we even start. We're gonna have to give you a new uh, paint here. There you go. You're much more bearable. Well, I'm right now I'm just trying to make a truck that will uh just get that done. So I want to uh whoops, that's not what I wanted to do. What I just wanna whoops. I don't know what I just did. I'm not paying attention to the buttons I'm hitting at the time. So first thing, as soon as I can get done with the... Uh, first thing is going to be get Juggernaut done. Then I'm going to repurpose it. That's going to go this way. You can't do that. Let me do that. Do it right there. Uh, okay. There we go. I don't even know if I got that one yet. Do I have that one? It's so unmemorable for me. I don't know. If, I don't really worry. Oh, that's that's from the rally DLC, isn't it? Yeah, I still need to get working on that. <laughs> I need to get working on that again. I did. I did some of it a couple weeks ago. Yeah, I got some more of the uh, Rally DLC done a couple weeks ago, but... Was there a reason I felt the need to do that? I actually like that Fiesta, too. All right, you okay? Surprise! I thought the pickups were rear, rear were rear wheel drive. For some reason that's weird. That's weird. Okay. Did I do what for the car challenge? I keep reading about some car challenge last month, but I don't. I don't remember hearing about it. Um, it, oh, it could have been. Yes. Probably was. Probably to do the, uh, what was it, Speed Trap, Speed Zone? It, oh, the awesome speed skills. That's probably what I did it for. Yeah, and I didn't feel like messing with the Viper. I feel like the Viper is like... I don't know. Well, I don't know if I've told, this be told you this before, but my dad used to have a uh, pickup. This was a Chevy, I forget what it was. I forget exactly what it was. He had a Chevy pickup. And can... Sure. Hmm. 
No other upgrades for that engine. Okay, that's cool. Appreciate that. 1,750 horsepower, sweet. But yeah, I used to love riding that thing. I don't even tell you what year it was. But it was silver. He had a silver Chevy pickup. Probably late 70s, early 80s. Definitely wasn't a K-10. I love how Chevy kind of goes from 1996 all the way to 2002, then to 2009, and then we're all the way up to 2015 because they can only go with Camaros and Corvettes. With the exception of the Colorado. Cool. This Colorado would probably be ridiculous on the uh, juggernaut as well. see old pickups who's got an old pickup old pickups um dodge might dodge might have some new ones nope oh that's right because they've got everything in ram in this game Moved it on RAM because and give us one power twenty five hundred. Good. Huge selection of Dodge trucks there, guys. Huge selection. Huge. Was I going for a hearse with this one? Could you imagine a super van as a hearse? That seems like a bad idea to me. This game really doesn't give you enough options for good old pickup trucks. I would like a good old pickup truck. One where you can throw your stuff and your kids in the back and just go out and ride. Obviously, I don't think they like you throwing your kids in the back, but... Great, I'm distracted.
that's not what I need. What am I doing? Here we go. So, Dead Master Jokes tonight, he said your family is not doing well. Um, so we're... Hold on just a sec. Hold on just a second. I'm going to mute chat real quick. Um... Oh, okay. Sorry about that. I'm back. You know what? This will be a lot easier if I do this. Yeah, I, I don't know. I think Twitch has been acting weird lately. It just, it just seems really weird that I've been hearing it from multiple people. It sounds it seems like Twitch has been acting weird lately with in terms of things working and not working. So now I've got my phone right um, set up so I can see uh, on the Xbox app. Okay, my question is, why do I feel the need to make a peel with, uh, PLP-50 with drift tires? That was a very bad idea. Let's see. Oops, oops. Hang on, there we go. <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, that is. Okay. Can't go wrong with a dually GMC. GMC dually, you can't go wrong. Cannot go wrong with that. All right, let's not play with the PLP-50 anymore. All right, so let's try the K-10 first. So we'll get that tuned up. Where is the K-10? K-10, there you are. But yeah, you got it. Gotta, gotta get more pickups in this game. Older pickups like that. I mean, yeah, I'm sorry that people have their addiction to uh, all the hyper cars and stuff, but I don't, I don't feel like that's all this game should be.
So at least get some of your usable. Let's make you throw, let's make you, I can somewhat throw you around. Great, now it's going to bug me what truck my dad had when I was young. Yeah, that's going to be, uh, whoops. What am I doing here? There we go. There we go. All right. Let's take this out for a drive. Oh, yes. There we go. All right, this gets thrown around like crazy, and it is good. All right, make two runs that, uh, two juggernaut runs before calling it, whoops, before calling it a night. That's not what I meant to do. <laughs> That's exactly the plan. That is exactly the plan. Grab it by the scruff of the neck and just and just go for it. Let's try doing the fast travel there first, though. I just real okay. This does not help anything. Why did there we go? I wonder I couldn't tell what was going on. Um, Juggernaut is... Where is Juggernaut? Juggernaut is behind me. Jeez. Let's hope I can just avoid stuff with this truck. KK-10. The 360 was not needed.
That was not helpful either. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what it is, but I've heard Twitch chat's been having issues. I've actually seen it having issues. Stop getting hooked on everything. Got to remember, I got to hit a slightly off to a side here. I think the problem I'm going to have is that it's going to be, uh, no matter what I try to use, I feel like it's going to be, I'm not doing well enough navigating through the trees. All right, so we had the four, um, there it is, the X, XLT area. Oh, now I've got to see the leaderboard for that, uh... Oh, the leaderboard is how... how your, um, how much time you have remaining when you uh, finish it. So how much time is left on the clock? I almost don't want to see this one.
Yeah, they might want to clear. They might just want to clear the leaderboard. They they should cl just clear the leaderboard. Every one of you that I'm scrolling past right now, you are all cheaters. Every one of you, every one of you. Hundred and thirteen times on there are abs have no time at all elapsed. Jeez. I was hoping to see what it, good times were, but when you got 113 times where nothing elapsed, absolutely nothing elapses, then you got point one point zero point zero one eight seconds. Once there, this is in the one second range. But yeah, it's you start with five minutes, so the time is how much time you have left on the clock when you cross the fin when you cross that finish line on the temple. This is stupid. We're only in the seven second range now. Now we're in eight. Yeah, right now we're at 380 seconds. And there is nothing legit right now. Yeah, that's a lot of scrolling. You are not wrong about that. Yeah, I don't think anything inside the top 100,000 right now is going to be legit. I really don't. There is no way that any of that is, uh... There is no way any of that's legit. Alright, let's tune this thing. Oh, this is... okay. Huh? 
game. How? Game, you broke in. Game, you broke in. Thirty two miles per hour game, what are you doing? Game. Thirty two point one miles per hour. I mean, I know how this happens. It doesn't make sense how this happens. It happens based on the way that they simulate the drive avatars driving your vehicle. Either that or there's something really, really wrong here. Nope, there is something really, really wrong here. Alright, um, have a good one, and I will see you later. And I think I'm going to head off for the night, too, since it is midnight. So I should be back Tuesday? Don't know yet. Um, we'll keep looking into it, but I will also try to figure out why this truck got stuck at 32 miles per hour initially. Hang on, let's take one last look at this. One last look. Buena Esperanza. A good view. Oh yeah, I think 32 miles per hour is it. I don't know, this game's broken. All right, I am going to get going. Should be back Tuesday night, but we will see what's going on. So, until then, have a good one.